Okay, these are complex problems, reverse digit problems. Once you know the pattern, and if you can remember it, they're pretty easy, but setting them up can be kind of complex. Okay, so let's read it. When the, when you reverse the digits in a certain two-digit number, you increase its value by nine. Find the sum of its, di uh, find the number, so, this would be the original number that you're trying to find. Uh, when the sum of the digits, so in the original number, the sum of the digits is 5. All right. But it also says that when you, re when you reverse it, uh, when you reverse the X and the Y, right? So you've got this two-digit number that looks like this. When you reverse it, that number is increased by 9. All right, I'm going to erase that because that doesn't really matter. So here's the complex part. So we're going to break up in a two-digit number. There's the tens. So the tens column would be the X's. The ones column would be the Y. All right, the new number you're going to reverse the X and the Y, right? It's, there's a, a two digit number, right? The sum of those two digits, right? So we're going to reverse. So now it's 10 Y plus one X. That's the new number. But when you reverse the values increase by nine. So what you do is you take the new number, subtract the original number to get the increased value of nine. Well, the new number is 10y plus 1x. The original number is 10x plus 1y. All right. Well, 10y subtract 1y is 9y. And I'm going to put the 9y, since we usually like to read it x plus y, I'm going to put the 9y here. And then 1x subtract, oops, there's supposed to be an x right there. 1x subtract 10x is negative 9x. Now we have our x and y. Well, great. Now we've got this x plus y equals a number, right? Well, now we can come back to the original information that they gave us, which is x plus y is equal, when you add the sum of the digits, it's equal to 5. Well, now we have a system. The problem is none of, neither of the variables will eliminate. So if I multiply this whole row by 9, and then this, the sum by 9, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to now say negative 9x plus 9y is equal to 9, and then 9 times x is positive 9x, 9, 9 times y is positive 9y, 9, 9 times 5 is 45. And now we have a system that when you add the columns, the x's cancel, 9y plus 9y is 18y, 9 plus 45 is 54. When you divide both sides by 18, the y digit is 3. So we come up here at the original. So x plus 3 is equal to 5. Subtract 3, subtract 3. The 10 digit, the tens digit is 2. So 23, the sum of those digits is 5. And then when you reverse it, you have, so when you reverse it, you, you have 32, and now look it. The increase in those two values is 9. 32 subtract, subtract 23 is 9. There you go. That is it. Now, wait, wait, I'm going to add this. So for those of you who like patterns, from now on, if you can remember, here, let me highlight it this way.
If you can remember that this is what it's going to equal each time is that when you reverse the digits and you do all this other work, you get negative 9x plus 9y is equal to whatever it's reversed. Well, then from now on, you can just say, oh, okay, so the original equation, the sum of the digits, and then when you reverse the digits, if you can remember this piece of information right here, and then that's going to be equal to whatever that thing is, then you're in pretty good shape. But for those of you who can't, don't remember that easily, this is how you would do those steps. All right, I'll probably do one more video on this to show you how you can cut to the chase and go directly to that. All right, that's it for this one.